Well, I want to start by talking to you guys about two great Australians, Tim and Peter Costello. These men are brothers, and both these men had encounters with Jesus when they were young. One of them grew up to be a pastor, and the other grew up and became the treasurer of Australia and was for 11 years. And what's interesting is that both these men chose to live a life of obedience to God. They chose to honor him with their lives. So I want to um, talk a little bit more about each man. I want to start with um, Peter. Peter Costello was, um, grew up in Victoria, went to a Christian school called Carey Grammar. Then at the end of school, went to university, Monash University, and he came out as a lawyer. At the age of 32, he became a member of parliament. And from 1996 to 2007, Peter Costello was the treasurer of Australia when John Howard was the prime minister. In the, after the 2007 election, um, he wrote his, his memoirs in 2008. And on page 20 of, of, of this um, book that he wrote, this is what we read. At the Baptist Sunday School, I was taught the lessons of the Bible and the Christian faith. This faith has been important to me throughout my life. As I grew older, the gospel became more meaningful and personal to me. It has given me a framework by which to steer my direction in life. I would not claim to be exemplary in behavior, but my faith has given me the certain hope of God's forgiveness and redemption. Attending church has been important in nurturing my faith. I owe a lot to my Sunday school teachers and pastors and my parents for sharing these great truths with me. Um, great little clip there. A man who encountered Jesus as a, as, a, as, a, as a young boy and then chose to live a life of honoring God. His brother has a different story. Um, his brother, Tim, he was the CEO of World Vision for 13 years. And World Vision is an organization that sponsors kids. And in 2019, they had over 3 million kids sponsored throughout the world. Incredible. Um, Tim grew up also in Victoria, went to the same school, but his life went on a different path. When he was a CEO of um, World Vision, this is what was written about him on their website. I'm going to read this to you. Tim Costello was ordained as a Baptist minister in 1984 and ministered at the Collins Street Baptist Church in Melbourne. From 1986 to 1994, he ministered at St Kilda Baptist Church where he established a vibrant and socially active ministry. In 1993, his commitment to serving the community led him to becoming the director, the executive director of Urban Seed, a Christian not-for-profit outreach service for the urban poor. Between 1999 and 2002, he was also national president of the Baptist Union of Australia, and he was a CEO of World Vision from 2003 through 2016. Tim, different story. But what's great about this story is that both these men had encounters with Jesus when they were young. One became a Baptist minister and then a leader of a huge not-for-profit that saw many lives changed. The other became a lawyer and eventually a member of parliament and a treasurer. But both these men chose to live lives that, that honoured God, that was obedient to God. 